Good day everyone, welcome to Senior Pablo TV. And for today's tutorial video, we will continue the models in algebraic expressions. This time we have the cube of a binomial. So notice in our topic, cube of a binomial. So let's say we have a binomial, A plus B, then we're going to get the cube. If we are going to expand this, the equivalent of that is a plus b times a plus b times a plus b. Three. So we're going to get the product of that. Then we can use the FOIL method. Or we can simply use the following steps. Step number one. Cube the first term of the binomial. Second, square the first term times the second term. times 3. So we need to square the first term times the second term then after getting the product times 3. And for the third step, square the second term times the first term times 3. Okay. Square the second term times the first term times 3. And for the last term, cube the second. And now let us apply our shortcut in our cube of a binomial. So let's have this example. So our answer must be cube the first term, so a cube. Next, square the first term, so we have a squared times the second term times 3. So we have 3a squared b. Square the first term times the second term times 3. Then, next, square the second term times the first term times 3. Positive 3 a, B squared. And last, cube the second term. Plus B cubed. So, notice to check your answer. Our first term corresponds to its exponent. So, it, it is in the decreasing order. 3, 2, 1. Then we don't have A here. In B, so we don't have B, then B raised to 1 b raised to 2 and b raised to 3. In here, b raised to 0. Now, if we have a minus b cubed, so this is just the same like this one, but we, we're going to change the sign. So that will become a cubed minus 3a squared b plus 3ab squared plus a minus b cubed our sign will be alternate. Positive, negative, positive, negative. Now, let us try this example. Let's say we have 2m plus 1 cube. Cube the first term, that is 2 times 2 times 2, which is 8. Then we have m cube. Next, square the first term, it's 2 squared, times 1, that is 4, times 3, positive 12m squared. Then square the second term, 1 squared is 1, times the fir first term, which is 2, times 3. 2 times 3 is 6m. And cube the second term, plus 1. 
this will be the product. Next, what if we have 5x minus 2y raised to 3? So 5 cubed, that is 5 times 5 times 5. 125x cubed. Next, this is minus, so our sign must be alternate. So minus, square the first term. That is 25 times 2, 50 times 3, 150. So we have x cubed here, therefore we have x squared. Then y raised to 1. Now for the sign, minus, next will be plus. Square the second term, so 2 squared 4 times 5. 20 times 3, so 60. Then for the exponent, so we have x, then y squared. Then last term, minus cube, 2 times 2 times 2, that is 8. Then we have y cube. This will be the final answer. And now your turn. And the answer number three. Let's say we have four a squared minus two b cubed. Okay. If you want to try number three, pause the video. Then after answering, resume, resume watching to check your answer. Four cubed. Four times four times four. That is sixty-four. So we have a power to a power, we need to multiply, so we have raised to 6. Minus, so alternate must be our sign. Square the first, so 4 squared times 2. So if you want, you can write now our exponent. So our uh, exponent and the variable, so our next will be a raised to 4 y, now uh, a raised to 4b, plus a squared, b squared, minus b cubed. Let us find the coefficient. So we square the first term, 16 times 2, 16 times 2, 32 times 3. So times 3. 32 times 3, that is 96. So we have 96. We have the variable and exponent. Next, square the second term. 2 square 4 times 4. That is 16 times 3. So we have 40. Now cube, we have 2 cube, which is a 2 times 2 times 2. And this will be the product. If we're going to expand quantity 4 a squared minus 2b, close parenthesis, cube. That is on how to do the cube of a binomial. If you want to watch more exercises, please go to grade 8 playlist, special products. Thank you for watching Senior Pablo TV.